Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Nicole Samavilla, and we are continuing to follow a developing story out of Syracuse University. Several members of a campus fraternity are now linked to at least one of those racial incidents that have taken place on campus over the past couple days. SU has now suspended all fraternity social activities until the end of the calendar year. News Channel 9's Adrian Smith caught up with students on the SU Hill sharing their thoughts on the issue. So they just need to do something, anything that shows that they actually care. After at least six racially biased incidents at Syracuse University beginning November 7th, the school taking steps to move forward. Around 6 a.m. Sunday morning, a statement sent to all students, faculty, and staff from Chancellor Kent Severud, suspending all fraternity social activities for the rest of the semester. This comes after the Department of Public Safety linking several members of a campus fraternity to at least one of the racist incidents. I honestly just kind of think it's a band-aid to the issue. Um, I think it might prevent certain things because they can't get together um, and that might prevent things from happening, but it doesn't really address the underlying issues that are plaguing the campus right now of people just not respecting each other. And I think he was trying to move in the right direction, but like ultimately like it won't work out in my opinion. Severut says while only one fraternity may have been involved, he believes all fraternities need to reflect on this behavior. And many students still protesting for stronger action. I know like the students who were part of the uh, protest in the Barn Center created a short list of demands and like a long list of demands. So I think if those were to be done first, then we'd probably see more change on campus. I just hope that the campus actually or that the like, chancellor and the administration actually listens to the, dem the demands of the students because um, it seems at times that the administration is really disconnected from what the students really like believe and what we really need. Students are continuing to protest in the Barn Center. They say that they'll give Chancellor Severud until Wednesday to take formal action. Meanwhile, the Department of Public Safety is continuing to investigate the other incidents, including the anti-Asian and anti-African American graffiti found in several residence halls. Nicole? Adrian, thank you. A university donor offered a reward for evidence that leads to the individual or groups responsible. This is a story we will be following very closely on the air and localsyr.com. Now, anyone with information is being asked to contact Syracuse Police. The department is helping with this investigation. Their number is 315-442-5222.